Hello, once more everyone, welcome back to the channel back here on this Friday edition for another MLB prediction video for this weekend's MLB on ESPN Sunday night baseball between the Boston Red Sox and the New York Yankees. Red Sox on Sunday night, coming up in two day, three days time on Sunday. Have Brian Bello coming in with a 3-4 and four with a 2.96 ERA. And the Yankees have Clark Schmidt going in with a 2-6 and six record and a 4.97, I think, or something like that. So... Really high ERAs, unfortunately, for the two pitchers going on Sunday match, Sunday night's game on ESPN. And the Yankees and Red Sox are saving the best matchup for last. Pitching matchup for last, a matchup where it could be high scoring coming up <clears throat> on Sunday night, which means there's going to be some plentiful hitting to see in this matchup on Sunday night and more. And it's also the first time these two teams have played. Starting a series tonight on this Friday is the day I'm filming this. For the prediction video, <clears throat> Yankees coming into tonight before the series finishes on Sunday, which is the game we're doing the predictions for. Yankees coming into tonight to start the series on Friday here on this day. 10 games over 500, 37 27. Red Sox coming in 31 and 32. And as always, Rory Jr. is on air. Here he is. There he is. Hey, last week we both picked the Dodgers over the Yankees. We're wrong. I have a 5 and 4 record. Rory Jr. has a 4-5 and five <clears throat> with the matchups. And Yankees at home, 10 games over 500 against the Red Sox for a game under 500 tonight, starting Friday. For Sunday, the matchup, I'm going to take in the Yankees because I think the Yankees lineup is going to be good. Even though without Aaron Judge, the Yankees still figure out how to hit without him in their lineup. Anthony Rizzo, Stanton's there. Josh Donaldson's been there in his first year, second year, I guess. <clears throat> All pretty good. Red Sox, on the other hand, they're coming in with a new roster this year almost. In the batting order, made a lot of moves this offseason to make themselves better to try to make it to the playoffs. And who knows? Earlier this year, all five teams in the American League East were above 500 at one point or another. At the same time, they're all above 500. But I'm taking the Yankees this week. Who are you here? Do you like, buddy? Really? You're going with the visiting team, the Red Sox? Really? I guess you heard it here first. Sorry, Yankees fans. The umpire is going down, according to Rory Jr. He's taking the Red Sox. I'm taking the Yankees. We'll see who's right this week. <clears throat> who's right this week. That being said, I hope you all enjoyed. You know what to do. Please remember to watch, like, subscribe. Don't forget to tell your friends to do the same if they have not done so yet already. Also, don't forget to hit that notification button below so you know when I upload a new video. And with that being said, have a nice night. Stay safe. And I will see you coming up in the next MLB prediction video right back here next Friday. So stay tuned, stay safe, peace out, and I'll see you next Friday, everyone.